is your Arklamas news source. Voted best newscast and best weather. This is NBC 10 News, first at four. Hello and thank you so much for joining us for your first at four. I'm Cindy Langston with your South Arkansas News. Our top story at this hour, two shooting suspects in Camden are granted continuance for a shooting that happened back in 2022, while two others received prison sentences. Keaton Arnold, Tyrese Henry, Carlton Henry, and Zakiel Gully were all charged in the fatal shooting of Andretti Austin on September the 6th, 2022. Officers discovered Austin's body in the driveway of a home. The owner of the home had been shot also, but survived. The homeowner told police that the attackers came in through the back door and forced the family to the ground at gunpoint. The suspects opened fire and fled shortly after. Austin, the deceased, was later discovered to be one of the attackers. Gully allegedly admitted that the plan was called hit -a -lick, slang for coming into money or robbery. Both Henry brothers were granted a motion of continuance this week until December the 11th. Gully pleaded guilty to the amended charge of conspiracy to commit first-degree battery and was sentenced to five years in prison and five years suspended in position of sentence. Arnold was charged with accomplice to murder. And in crime news tonight, the South Arkansas, or a South Arkansas man, rather, is accused of firing a gun during an argument with his wife. Just after midnight on Saturday, Camden police were called to a domestic dispute with possible shots fired. Upon arrival, officers made contact with the homeowner's son, Deshaun Bradley, who allegedly advised officers that he was arguing with his wife and fired a gun. Bradley then went to put his infant daughter to bed and allegedly fled the scene by climbing through a bedroom window. Bradley was eventually arrested. And in the courts, a 